color the vertices using the greedy coloring algorithm. So in the greedy coloring algorithm, what we're going to do is go basically in alphabetical order. So I'm going to use some colors. Uh, let me start with maybe B. Let's call this color number one. It will be blue. The color number two is going to be green. Color number three, let's say, is red. And then if we need it, let's say color number four is black. Okay, so starting at A, we're going to use color number one, which is blue. So I'm going to color that in with blue. Okay, the next number, or next letter, is B. So I can't use blue again, because then those would connect with the same colors. I'm going to use the next color, which is green. Okay, so this is color one, this is color two. The next letter is C. So C is connected to A and B, so I can't use one or two, so i got to use the next one, which is three. The next letter is D. D is connected to color two and color three. But before using four, we're just going to go back to number one again. So we're going to go, always go to the lowest color every time you can. So instead of using the four, I'm going to use one again. Okay, the last letter is E. So E is connected to the one, so I can't use that one. Two, can't use that one. Three, can't use that one. So I have no choice. i got to use the fourth one. Okay, so this one needed four colors using the greedy coloring algorithm. Let's look at another one. We use the same order again. So blue is going to be number one. So starting at letter A, we're going to start with color number one. The next letter is B. So B is connected to A, so I can't use one again. So I'm going to go to number two. The next letter is C, which is not connected to A or B, so I can Go back to color one again. D is connected to one, so I can't use that. D is not connected to the B there, so I can use two again. The next letter is E. E is connected to one and two, so I can't use one or two, so the next one will be three. Next letter is F, which is only connected to three. So I'm going to go back to color one again. I always go to the lowest color. E, F, G. G has a connection with three and two, so I'm going to go back to one again. H is connected to one and one, so the next lowest color would be the two. I is only connected to the one, so the next color is two. And then J is connected to the one and two, so I gotta go to color three. Okay, so using the greedy coloring algorithm, we needed three colors for this one.